Megahorn. So you can kill Shadow Lugia too. Oh my god, stop! What's up everyone, it's Tyranitar Tube and welcome back to the Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. I got no more expectations. We just fought a woman with no head and she wants us to come back. She wants us to- she's like Sabrina. She seriously is like Sabrina. Now, our team is kind of screwed up because we lost one member and a lot of our PP is gone. Like Damage's signature V-Create. So, I've gone ahead and tried reteaching TMs to see if that would revive its PP. <sighs> Take me serious, damn it. But it works. Blizzard and Searing Shot are back to normal. So is Smyrda's Sacred Fire. I only needed to use three Lepa Berries, so we have five more of that, as well as a bunch of Elixirs and Ether. So I think we should be good. But the last thing we need to do is get rid of this, because Damage doesn't need his Toxic Orb anymore, because he's poison. That's the whole point of the Toxic Orb. And I don't want to give him a defensive item. Like, we do have Leftovers, which would be sick. It would recover like 15% of its health every turn. But, I don't think damage is gonna need that much. Like, he's not gonna sit in for multiple turns after taking a hit. That guy's gonna leave. Focus Sash might work. I predict damage will die. Don't die, damage. Do not die. Seriously, dude. Yo, he might die! You know, I'm gonna give- I don't- I used my potions. Any berries. I just wanna fully heal him up. I know after one turn, he can use his Focus Sash again because of the poison heal. But, I don't trust him. Orin Berry. All I need. Perfect. Perfection! Look, I could be I could be your new head. This is amazing. Let's be friends. Let's be friends with benefits. Let's just go up here. So this is the Okay, this room was not like this before. I know that for a f this is Glacia's room. Oh my god. I was right. I was right. Sydney's room didn't change. Phoebe's room didn't change because they're still Sydney and Phoebe. We know that the third member is no longer Glacia. So it's room. So her room is not icy anymore. It's grassy or buggy. It could be a grass or bug type Elite Four member now. I don't know any grass or bug trainers though. There's Bugsy. And I think Sinnoh had a gym leader that was grass. And Kalos had a gym leader that was grass. Yeah, the old dude. But that's sick. We can pretty much figure out. I don't know if we can figure it out. But we have a hint at who the real Elite Four member is. But so far we know that the first one is Sydney. The second one is Phoebe. And the third one is some grass type user. Pretty sure it's grass. That looks so cool. But I don't know why it's freaking snowing. Is the, like Glacia just retiring? They can't get rid of the snow? Yeah, you kind of... I mean, grass doesn't like snow. So you kind of screwed over this guy. I'm hoping it's like a girl. Because that would even out male and female. And there'll be no hate. So I just googled Glacia's room. And this is definitely a brand new room. I just gotta explain the hail or the snow. Oh, this is the point where all the snow falls. Look at that. It just goes into the ground. Freaking cheaters. You see that? But it's funny to think that, like, construction workers have to come and, like, oh, we gotta get this hail out of here. It's time for grass. And then it's like, oh, we'll finish the rest of it later. Tomorrow. Maybe the next time we come in here, it'll be finished. But see, that raises the question. If Glacia is a former Elite Four member and. Right now, we're fighting temporary members. Could this be Glacia? I mean, it makes total sense. She wouldn't have to answer the call to Kanto. But I mean, she's still a strong trainer. They called Juan. They'd probably call Glacia as well. I'm curious to who you are. Who the hell is this? Look like Professor... Is that Professor Birch? Nice Kelvin Klein belt. Dude, that is totally Professor Birch. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Look at those aviator glasses, black suit, Calvin Klein belt, buckaroo shoes. That is totally Professor Birch. Look how serious he looks too. He's there like a security guard, like a bodyguard. What is this? Look at this chair. You know when you're like trimming your bush? Oh, freaking God. You know when you're trimming your hedges and you make it look like a dinosaur? This one looks like a chair. This is the best. This is amazing. I can feel the fluffiness. Why is there grass there? This is weird! I guess we could put damage in the front since this is a grass guy. But see, now I'm starting to think. Because May's strongest Pokemon was 81. And Phoebe's sister's strongest Pokemon was 83. Meaning that these guys are slowly starting to get a little too strong. But I'm not underleveled. Being underleveled is like being level 60 at a level 80 battle. Not level 70 at an 80. 
underleveled means you're the Pidgey that the champion crushes when he comes home. Just because you can't Oko a Pokemon does not mean you're underleveled. I hope no one thinks like that. Wish I could just release you. I don't like having dead Pokemon in my party. Hey, Professor Birch. Oh, uh, this guy is like a big Teletubby. He's huge. This is so weird. Look at this. We're the same level here. Hold my hand. How do I get you to hold? Look, hold my hat. Hold my hat. There you go. He's holding my hat. All right. You know, let's just talk. <laughs> He's so serious. Mm, that was a good burger. Uh, oh, hello there, young challenger. I am Agent B. I used to be a member of the Hoenn League, but now I'm an agent investigating odd activity in the Hoenn region. I saw what you did in Sutopla City. You've done well to make it here. It reminds me of when your father and I battled here many years ago. This is the final test. Prove now that the person who started your journey wasn't wrong in choosing you. <laughs> Prove beyond that. Show me what the future champion can do. Your glasses twitch. He's so damn serious. Agent B, Agent Birch. <laughs> That's totally Birch. That's the funniest thing I've seen. Elite 4 Agent Birch. Yeah, get out of here. Landorus? He said a few things there. Whoa! It looks like we're in a bowl of jelly. I don't know why I'm so intrigued that the room is not Glacia's room anymore. Oh, you've got the legendary Tyranitar ability. So I want to pause here for a second because he said a few things. He said he used to be in the Elite Four and that he's Agent Birch. Now, is he Agent Birch because he's trying to hide from me? Or is he actually an agent and then he was just a professor to give me my Pokemon? And second of all, was he really in the Elite Four? Or is he making that up? Because I could totally see this guy in the Elite Four with this kind of Pokemon. So, a level 84 Landorus. Damn, man, he's stronger than Mavis. You take it, Mavis. No, Mavis. Take him, Mavis. Don't be a bad boy, girl. I don't know. So, man, see, Landorus level 84. Look what that does to the bar. It raises it. it raises it how much? I don't know. Yeah, I canceled out your sandstorm. What you gonna do now? Diamond Storm, he was trying to kill me. You little fart. See, but that's the thing. Whether that was a Landorus or a Cricketune, it could still have Diamond Storm to kill me. So you can't say, oh, uh, why would you go into a fire type on a ground type? Because it's the same thing with every Pokemon. Most water types don't even have water moves, for example. So, I'm an origin post you. So you really have to use, like, past experiences to learn off this. You have to learn every Pokemon from the beginning. Oh, you survived? Megahorn. So you can kill Shadow Lugia too. Oh my god, stop! Please die to the hail. Oh my god. I'm gonna blizzard you. I don't even need you to do anything. Just die. You gotta use like past experiences. Like we had a Cresselia with Imposter. We had... Yeah, it did have Imposter. We also had a Cofagrigus with Fur Coat. And then we learned that Phoebe's Giratina had Wonder Guard. So you use those past experiences to do well later on in the game you seriously didn't level up porygon z so you can't just say that i'm only winning all the battles through luck because if <laughs> there was luck i would not be surviving this much no one gets this much luck so porygon z i think maybe cross shmurda let's go into cross i think cross can do it cross can do everything i kind of wish i stayed into mavis a bit more just what leveled up but man, level 84, that's almost 10 above cross. So Porygon Z, this thing is a cracked out Pokemon. Just look at it. It's like a squeaky duck toy. It's even got a little horn. What is that? I don't even have any good moves for you. I'm just going to Fusion Bolt you. I don't think Fusion Bolts can paralyze. I've never paralyzed with it. I think it's Free Shock and Ice Burn that do it. Draco Meteor? Does this thing have Contrary? No, it doesn't. Why would you use Draco Meteor? That's so stupid. I don't even want to transform into... Oh. What? Is this thing a physical attacker then? Does it just use Draco Meteor hoping to get its special attack back? I'm going to Fusion Bolt you. Match this thing uses like U-Turn now. That's it. I'm dead. Overheat. This Pokemon is stupid. 
I don't get your strategy. To have the luck for Moody to boost your special attack again is impossible. Yeah, it, it just, it just lured it again. Oh, speed. Oh. No. Oh. Now look what you did to yourself. I, I kind of just want to, like, take advantage of this thing. Which is kind of a rude thing to say. Heal up. You're not going to heal up? Professor Birch knew, or Agent Birch. He knew this wasn't worth healing up. That's hilarious. Look at that, it's cracked out. I need someone to level up, Waylord. I want to go into Mavis just to level it up. Or I could go into Shmurda. Should I go into Shmurda? What can Shmurda do? Can Shmurda level up? It can't. Probably can't. You know, let's just go into Shmurda. I think Shmurda can handle it. Shmurda can handle everything. Shmurda is the best. 10 out of 10. Look, you fit in this room. This is the bowl of gel you've been wishing for. And that's a big blimp. I'm probably faster, so I could transform. Or I can seed bomb you. I can throw my seeds. Whoa! Whoa! Free shock. Freeze shock. That's Zekrom's move, meaning it's a physical attack. I could go into damage and sketch it. Should I? Would I ever use damage? No, because that makes damage vulnerable for one turn. Now, you know what? Guess what? I'm gonna the sacred fire you. This better. <gasps> no, that was so stupid. <laughs> no, let the hate roll in. I don't know why I did that. Okay, if you want me to put my thinking cap on, you grade two teacher, then I will. That was literally the stupidest thing I've ever done. I could have seed bombed him, but did I? I didn't. Just die. See? He does have a full restore. He on purposely didn't heal up his Porygon Z. Okay, look, the only reason I survived that is because I got good karma. Okay? And if I have good uh, what the Oh yes, teeth! Is that a good way to change it? Or here's a question. Is it teeth or horns? Those are some nice horns. Oh my god. I gotta heal. You know what? I got an idea. I'm gonna heal up. And then you're going to use free shock. And then I'm going to seed bomb you. I'm going to do it the right way. Should I hyper? I'm going to hyper potion. Thankfully, we do have a full set of full restore. So we're not that bad. We just got to last two more battles after this one. Steel wing? What do you mean? What do you mean? You can't fly with your tail. That's illegal. I kind of want to just transform into it. If I try... I'm going to... Ah, uh, that's stupid. Because it's just going to send in like an electric type. Then I got to switch out. Die. Die. Actually, no. Whale Lord would be bad. Because Whale Lord's defense mostly comes from its HP. Hariyama. Hariyama Yama? Hariyama Yama? Yama Hariyama? Mama Hariyama. Mama Mama. I'm going to side strike you. Hey Hariyama. How you doing? Freaking baseball players. I can't believe there's a baseball Pokemon. Not a baseball Pokemon, but a baseball player. Like, imagine you go to a baseball game, it's just one player, and then like five Hariyamas. Five Hariyama Llamas. Don't do anything stupid! What the hell? But your skull looks like it's made out of Play Doh. It's like shiny. How'd you do that? Wow. Wow, of course! I was just gonna say, well, if it doesn't even have good special attack, how did it do that much? No, I mean, if you're gonna Skull Bash, maybe I can quickly Teeter Dance you. Oh, you're faster. Are you gonna kill them now? No, you're not. Okay. Freaking didn't shower, now it smells. That's what happens. If you don't shower, you get Poison Touch. This is why I have no friends. Hariyama. Die. To... Uh, actually... Should I even sit here? Why am I doing this? I'm seriously just wasting... Actually, no. Because if I can get W to take the attacks, then it'd be better for everyone else. Hit yourself. It's good. What the hell, man? Like, I'm teaching you proper life lessons. Get a crit, Wabba. Wabba, Wabba. That was amazing. Look what you did. It's like mocking me. I feel like I want to go into a 10, but that's right. Don't say it. It's not nice. This poison is adding up. Is it toxic poison or normal poison? You know what? I think it's time 
to go into cross. Welcome to the Shadow Realm. Both your ears look like they're part of the Shadow Realm. They're gates to the Shadow Realm. His ears are gates to the Shadow Realm. Look at that. Oh my god, he can catch baseballs with his ears. That is just the best. Whoa, you're faster? <gasps> oh! No, that has to be a priority attack. There's no way you're faster. You can be faster than a Wawa Fit, not Shadow Lugia. That makes no sense. That's why you're just a catcher. You can't even be a pitcher. That hurts. That hurts a lot. Darmanitan! He's got his own damage. I don't think we've ever seen a trainer with damage Mavis or Shmurda. I've never seen a trainer have a Milotic, Darmanitan, or Victory Bell. This is the first one. But if it's a Darmanitan, could I go into it? Could I go into my Darmanitan and sketch it? Because it's probably faster than me. But if it has a super effective attack, I'm probably dead. Oh, Focus Ash! Oh my god, I predicted this! I saw it all. I'm gonna do it. I just have to hope it's not a Zenmo Darmanitan. Because then it's a special attacker and I don't want your side strikes. Zenmo Darmanitan is actually really good. It's like a special Victini. Look at this. It's a monkey party. Look at this. Yeah, yeah. This beat. Yeah, not it, not it. They're talking. Shut up, they're talking. Let them talk. You see my teeth? They're white. Oh, you brush too? Yeah, yeah, I do. So what gender are you, dude? I don't know, man. I don't have any genders. You don't have a gender either. What am I doing? You know what? Let's do this. Sketch. He's faster than me. I have a focus sash. Unless he uses... Even like if he uses water shuriken. I should be able to survive. I'm faster? And he has... Pre no! No, no, no. I want precipice blades. Please miss again. Mississippi again. M m yen. 90,000 Japanese yen for you. Please, miss again. Oh my god, this is not gonna happen. I need him to miss. Please miss. And miss and then go for it again. Why am I faster? Am I faster? Is this a speed tie? No! He hit! And I survived. I didn't even need the focus sash. Oh my god, I really need to sketch precipice blades. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try healing up. Meaning I have to use a full restore. I'm gonna heal up. This is gonna be so bad. I No, I can't! If I heal up, then I'm not poisoned anymore. I just got myself suck, suck into ducks. I mean, I can take a precipice blade, so I just have to use a hyper potion. Please don't do anything stupid. Use a, use a weak attack. Use a weak attack. Sacred fire? No, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. I need him to use... Precipice blades and then miss cuz I'm faster than him Maybe he's like pure attack and no speed. I don't know. I got to heal up again I'm working so hard just to get this move, but I haven't used my focus sash yet. What I need is For you to use precipice blades and miss like you did the first time. Just do that again Okay, just do it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I got the plan. Yeah flaming eyebrows don't lie Yes, yes Yes! You listened! I can draw. Yes! And you did it again. Hey, guess what, dude? Die. No! Oh, I'm sorry! Oh, God, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. Ow, 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 ow. Dude, what the hell? I want to go. What if he has pursuit? That was stupid. Dude, damage has precipice blades. Mavis has origin pulse. Now we just need Shmurda to get Dragon Ascent. Okay. I'm... Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shoot. I can't go into anyone. I'm faster, though. I'm faster. I could kill you with Thousand Arrows, probably. You know, let's do this. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? I'm pretty sure I can. Darmanitans don't have good uh, defense. There you go. Dude, that was clutch. That was amazing. That was, that was perfect. Imagine I sketched Sacred Fire somehow. That would have been so bad. Oh my god. Swamp Birds. Swamp Birds? 
I don't trust the Swamp Bird. I want to go into Shmurda, but I seriously think he probably has like Ice Punch. I definitely can't stay in. Cross has Seed Bomb, but it might have a Bug Attack. Should I go into W and try like clearing it? I don't know if that's a good idea. Or I could just go into Mavis. What does Mavis have? Mavis... Mavis doesn't... Origin Pulse. You know what? I'm gonna go into Cross. I just have to hope it doesn't have a Bug Attack. But I got a full restore first. You don't do anything stupid, Swampert. You hear me? God, 85! That is crazy! Oh my god, already 85. That was how strong Steven's Mega Deancey was. Or the borrowed Mega Deancey, the one trainer had. Alright, it's time for our first full restore. How does it feel? Well, oh, this tastes so good. Well, oh, oh, tastes great. Tastes like sushi. Oh, of course! Mega Swamp Birds! Agent B's Mega Ring? I don't know what it said. Look at that, Mega Swamp Birds! That looks so cool! Oh! Oh, 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 oh! Stop! Holy crap! Oh, no, 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 no! Dude, die! Just die! Seriously, I'm not even playing games with anyone who has 1,000 waves. Look at that! Oh, stop! Stop, it hurts! Freaking Zygarde cells, get away! Stop! Oh my god, stop! Good! We're done! We won! Professor Birch killed no one! Thank you! That's what I expect from a professor! Don't kill my Pokemon! That was cool! You pass! That's cool! What if his damage killed my damage? How symbolic would that have been? Like the step to success by killing my starter. That was a lot of money! Thanks, dude! He's so serious. He's be my security guard if you want. You've done well, Tamo. I'm sure the man who gave you your first Pokemon would be proud to see you make it this far. Yeah, totally you. You're close, but don't underestimate your next opponent. Just like I, he had once defeated the Elite Four, but in another region. When we meet again, please don't hesitate to bring me a cheeseburger. <laughs> the hell is wrong with this guy? He's like the most chill security guard ever, and he looks like a big fat Teletubby. Do you notice how big this thing is? He's just a big blob. It's like Snorlax personified into a human. This is the stupidest thing, but the most amazing thing in my opinion is how the hedges were cut to make it look like a tree. Look at that. That is perfection. I want to take this home. I want to just end the episode here. That's all time for this episode. Be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed the episode. And let's smash 10,000 likes for the next episode. And let me know your thoughts on who you think this room belongs to. Because I seriously can't even, like, think of anyone. Like, I'm thinking of the guy from Kalos. The guy who's a gym leader. But he's a gym leader. He's an old gym leader. He should be even retire from being a gym leader. It doesn't make sense for him to be here. But that's it for this episode. I'll see you guys in the next video.